Hello guys, welcome to another one of my Warriors of Num Num videos. I'm celebrating the fact that I'm number one in the world in the Mythic Warriors and Warriors of Num Num. And uh, what I'm doing in this video series is pretty much playing through the different characters, showing you guys some of the different options with them. I did Bushi, I did Undo, did J uh, <laughs> I'm calling him Jing. Uh, now it's time to look at the champ, and the champ is the worst character for me to play. Champ's special ability is that you can multi-tap with up to three fingers. He has a special card that allows you to multi-tap with up to four fingers, but it's not faster for me to do this stuff. If I were playing on an iPad and I could go like this, it would be a win. Definitely, because I'm very very fast with two fingers. Three doesn't help me, it slows me down nothing on the phone so even though I have this guy's best cards uh, it's not going to I'm not gonna be using them and um, it's not because I don't want to show you guys it but it's just not very productive because they are expensive cards and um, or hard to get anyway but let's just remove this stuff here and look at what I will put in the deck so multi tap up to four fingers nah superb on an iPad plus one per tap mm. plus five per second if the opponent is Glenn so this here is his best card the apprentice Gabriella gives you one point per tap and two per second and it's a very uh, sort of like safe bet card to put in there because if your opponent penalizes you by reducing your points per click to one you're still going to get a bonus out of it you're going to be getting two points per second so that's definitely a card you want in but don't put it in first as I mentioned in the other videos there are cards that remove the first card on your list so uh, so never put your good cards in first um, then we have one point per tap we have two per second all these default cards that I've been talking about in the other videos as well and in the soup so since I don't really get anything out of multi-tapping and I'm quite good at tapping I'm going to put a piece of cake in first so that if I'm allowed to play with this I'm going to be able to benefit from being super fast at tapping then I'm going to put in the soup so that my opponent won't be allowed to click with a huge multiplier just one point per tap and the last card that I'm going to put in here is the special cards that are going to give me some degree of benefit. No matter what happens, I'm going to win something by adding this card in every game. There's a slight chance my opponent is going to select cards that affect me negatively both in the per second and per tap, but it's very unlikely. So this is the build that I'm going to be playing with and hopefully I'm going to be completing the rank that I am in now just playing this deck with this character in this video. I'm probably going to be holding my phone like this this way because that allows me to tap better on the food. I can better hit the plate on the food because this is a kind of small screen compared to really doing this. Um, so this is pretty interesting as you can see here. Right now I got two three penalty, two penalties. I'm getting frozen for five seconds where I can't click. My points are being reduced to one. So that's the in the soup card that we're using as well. So the only thing that I'm benefiting from is the two per second that our other card gave us. Uh, I'm also reducing my opponent's points per, per tap to one and uh, that really means that it pretty much comes down to who's best at clicking and besides that I am probably having the slight bonus of having plus two per second as well so this game here we really got a benefit from uh, from the cards we selected and only really lost the per click uh, but gain per second or kept it and uh, held our opponent down click wise enough to win so that was super cool first game with the champ a winning game so just pretty much going to complete hopefully this rank with this deck right now of course I need to play all the battles but I'm actually not expecting to see losing games so now we're up against somebody that could be full tapping but no penalty to us this time in that I'm going to be getting three points per click which is crazy because don't give me that stuff I'm just going to win and two per second and um, yeah 
when you're up against something, someone that clicks as much as I do, that's um, that's a one byte win really. So that was super cool. Um, the only thing really that's a problem is the in the soup card, and that's really as I said in the in the previous video where I was showcasing Chen, play Chen get coins enough to buy in the super card 900 coins then you play a little more serious or then you challenge your friends because you're going to be having a crazy advantage if they don't have it yet and then it's just super whooping time so once again here no penalties uh, meaning that we are getting full value for all our cards but that also means we're not restricting our opponent with anything so they could be getting 10 points per cap Per, per tap so uh, oh yeah we are we do have in the soup but they could be getting per per second is what I meant um, so that was another champ win but I mean it's the champ why would I lose so let's just move on to the next battle and really almost complete uh, this rank here playing the champ the champ the champ alrighty so this is a per second character and uh, no restrictions to me that I know of and all I need to really remember is that the opponent I'm playing is bound to be focused on getting the passives per second you can actually win games just by leaving your iPad or your iPhone with that character because he has such a high per second count if you're not up against somebody that's really good at clicking or has the right build you're just going to be winning like 30% uh, of your battles doing nothing uh, so that's also a very nice build I also did show that in another video so last game hopefully here with the champ and then this rank is completed very good I like it so let's see okay so this is the, like the master negative guy he's the one that has all the restrictions to other characters but we're not getting them I'm probably gonna get frozen uh, but that's okay so there it is I'm just continuing tapping as you can see we're getting our passive uh, but our opponent hasn't taken the first bite of the food yet uh, and we have now so even though we got restricted there not being able to click for a short time um, this is going to be a winning game where we benefit from both the per click and the per second and completing this rank in Warriors of Nam Nam. Thank you guys very much for watching.